Going to be GG, I think. We're going to win this Hawk Hunter deck. Look at the Phoenix, look at the Phoenix. Please, please, Phoenix, please help me here. And it's going to be GG, well played. What's up, guys? Here's the Spectre. So many welcome to your channel. And so many welcome to a traffic video. We are here to a gameplay Clash Royale for you. And I'm happy that I have time and I'm here to play the Clash Royale and learn some great, great tactics and great tips on how to play Golem. If you are watching my channel for the first time, don't forget to at first like my video, comment your opinion and also subscribe my channel. I need your support and your supporting me and your uh, subscription make me motivated and make me fresh to continue stronger than yesterday's. I am uh, gonna uh, battle on the uh, ladder boards uh, and uh, wanna learn some great tactics and tips to you and uh, please uh, stay keep with us with and at the end of the video and uh, we are here and I hope that we play some uh, great great gameplay that uh, some decks that you have problem against them I hope that we have some match in this video and the justice yes let's keep going and let's go so guys our first match let me increase the sound this is enough uh, so what should we do here it's going to be I'm gonna wait I'm gonna wait maybe it's a graveyard yes it's a splash yard it's a graveyard deck a great great answer by the specter the bomber and the lumberjack two great card to answer this uh, counter in my deck are lumberjack and bomber but look at my hp i get a good h i get our, our, our enemy gets a great hp and great damage from us So, because he plays his poison, I'm going to play my Nightwitch. But he has Ice Wizard. And I can't play my Phoenix because Ice Wizard and Nado is enough. So, it's a great, great arrow by the Spectre. He's going to activate his uh, Skeleton King and I'm going to play my E-Barbs. Surely he's play Ice Wizard, I'm sure. No, but look at the... Wow, he saw another Tombstone. Damn you, player. Damn you, Splash Yard. But I think he hasn't much elixir. And as you see, the Bomber and the uh, e barbs Wow, look at the Phoenix. It was a great, great Phoenix. I have to play my Phoenix. Because I can't ignore the Phoenix. Because if I ignore this card, uh, my tower will be down, I'm sure. So let's play our Lumberjack. He can't activate it because if he activated, wow, we are in lack of Alexir and uh, I wish I don't play my arrow and zap, but please die. Skeleton King, please die. He's going to play the Splash Yard, I think. No, it's good. So let's play. Now with here, he's going to play his Phoenix. Yes, and the Splash Yard, I think. Yes, our prediction is so, so great. So, look at our Phoenix. It survived and it's real live. And what is better than this? Nothing. So, again, an arrow ends up. Our enemy hasn't ice wizard. Uh, make uh, a little easier for us. And it's going to be vulnerable against this. Uh, splash yard deck. Splash yard is so hard counter deck with Golem, uh, against Golem first play and uh, I'm so so happy that I win this matchup. It's going to be 3 nail, but yes, it's 3 nail. So against this player, his name is Giant Lab. Looks like he's going to be a Lexir, no, Golden Giant, Giant or maybe Lexir Giant. But I love, I like that it doesn't be Lexir Giant. Look at our cycle. I haven't any Bomber, I haven't any Golem, I haven't any uh, Phoenix. So, so worst con, uh, cycle. So let's play our Zap. So let's play our... The most risk action in the Golem first play. Lumberjack and e -Bots. What is... 
Phoenix so so expensive for us. Look at his e-barbs. Look at his healer. And he's going to play an Elixir Golem. So it's Elixir Golem. So let's at first kill the healer. We lose our tower, but mm, I think we couldn't do any action better than this. Let's play Golem. I think uh, he's going to play his Electro Dragon or maybe uh, Baby Dragon. I think it's ele playing Electro Dragon. Yes, I'm right. So Lumberjack to kill the healer. You have to take this cover. But look at the Electro Dragon. It's so, so annoying me. I hope our Phoenix survive. Bow, bow. So bad. He's going to play. No, I don't. I think he don't want. Wow, wow. I I wanted to say because the healer isn't in the cycle. He don't want to play Legacy Golem, but now surely he play. So I'm going to play my E Bobs and the Phoenix. Take pressure. Look at here. You have to defend. Look at our Phoenix, it's going to survive. Our Golem, our next Phoenix, he's going to cycle his healer, but it's going to be GG I think, we're going to win this Hawk Hunter deck, look at the Phoenix, look at the Phoenix, please, please, Phoenix, please help me here, and it's going to be GG well played, <laughs> GG, we are, in, we are here in the next match against STR, Look at his deck. I don't know what's his deck. But look at our cycle. So, so worst. <laughs> we play our arrow and our enemy plays Dark Goblin. So, so great. It's a lag bit, I think. If he plays God Barrel, I'm going to play my Bomber, but... Uh, I think the, uh, this Wall Breaker could damage our E-Barbs, that, that, that's right. One of our E-Barbs. Uh, I mean, this E-Barbs is... GG, and... Let's play our Golem. He plays Dark Goblin, but I think... Uh, he shouldn't play his Dark Goblin. So let's play our bomber to defend this uh, god trail. Nine, which is here. It's so uh, hard matchup. Zap is going to play his dark open, I think. Or maybe fireball. But fireball is in, hand, in his hand. Let's uh, look at our nine, which. The Dark Goblin died, but our arrow uh, came late. I told you it's hard matchup. So I have to change my attacking area I and mean, I have to attack from this uh, area. Golem, please go, go, you go. And look at the Dark Goblin. Look, look at this Dark Goblin. Look 
Look at this dark open out, so... He's so, so lucky. But I think it's going to be GG for him. I think. I'm not sure. Yes, it's GG for him. He loses his both hover. And it was a so hard a situation for us in some moment of this game. I hope he, this matchup will be a expo. Uh, I haven't played uh, expo for long, against expo a long time. And uh, only I'm playing a hard counter deck. Uh, so, mini, minions and the Larmerjack. Mm, I, what a pity that I haven't my Larmerjack and I haven't my Bomber and I haven't my e -bobs. So I have to accept this Larmerjack. It's a so, so free, free damage for our opponent. And this is the uh, guilty of uh, Super Soul uh, Cycle. But so hard counter deck. Look at this wizard. And the Pekka and the Lumberjack. But I think he says Valkyrie. Yes. <laughs> Valkyrie and Pekka. What a toxic deck. Let's have a GG for him. But we have to keep this tower. Now I'm not so, so poor that uh, let the minions damage me. Um, our opponent. I'm talking against my opponent. He's going to play his Lumberjack, I think. I am, um, the Bomber is in hand, surely I will defend it. But uh, this 600 HP is not appropriate HP that I uh, stop attacking. I have to uh, battling, but it's going to be GG for left hover. But he uses Soul Electric. I think he just can play Wizard Valkyrie or just play Pekka, I think. If our Phoenix join us in this situation in our attacking, it's so, so great for us. Phoenix, please join the attacking. Yes, I think he's joining the attack. And look at this Nado. Maybe our Phoenix, yes, maybe our Phoenix could do anything for us. Wow, what a toxic deck. Look at our golem. Our golem goes here and now he is changing his way. Damn you, my golem. We are watching some miracle situation in this matchup. I'm so, so surprised that my golem changed his way. It's going to be GG, I think. It's going to be GG. Great, great matchup. Yes, it was great surprising. So we are in the, the second... Uh, we are in the... Uh, so in this matchup... Uh, look at our cycle. It's again worst. Let's play our bomber. Identify as your enemy deck. All opponents, all the players, the Clash Royale in the first uh, minute of the game, wanna uh, uh, keep their deck unknown and wanna disappear some uh, disappear some uh, magic cards in their cards. As you see, we take great great card from our opponent. We uh, take out great great card. Uh, Electro Wizard, Wizard, Hog, and also. Uh, Goblin Gang. Around five cards we take out from our opponent. And the Fire Spirit is going to be the sixth card. Only two cards remain. Maybe Spell. And maybe one of them is a Spell and one of them is Building cards. I don't know. So one of them is the e -bop. So just uh, his last card remains. And he's going to be... Uh, his, our opponent is one of Vanishes. I think uh, his last card, but I will take it down. It's going to be played as Wizard, I think. Yes, we predict so, so good. Our, our Zap, great, great Zap. And it's the, the, the power of the uh, Phoenix, I think. It's going to be 1 nil, but uh, our right tower will be down uh, in, I think. Yes, we lose our right uh, tower. 
you still have uh, one minute. So I'm going to wait. He want to play, I want to play my golem and uh, he want to play his hog rider, I'm sure. He's waiting for me and I'm waiting for him. Let's play some this emote. <laughs> I don't want to play my golem at all. So... <laughs> his last card is a freeze and he surprised me. I wanted to surprise him, but now he's surprised. It's going to be so, so hard matchup. Let's play our Nightwitch. Great, great column, I think. It's a great, great column. And look at our King Tower. Our King Tower is killing the Electro Wizard. The best situation, the best action that the, our King Tower could do is this action. He's going to play his, I think, Goblin Gang here. Wow, look at our Bomber. Look at our Bomber. And I think he's going to play his Freeze now. No, but uh, look at the left side. The Nivich and the Golem, it's... Again, it plays... Uh, Wizard, but I don't think so that he could defend, but he did. So let's play our e -bots. I'm Going to again freeze? No, no. You don't want to freeze. There is still a head in the tiebreaker, but uh, we should uh, kill his uh, and take his tower if we want to. Be a winner in this match. So he's gonna play his Hawk Rider from behind to gather our cards and freeze our cards. These tactics are so old against me. Great, great spell. And I think it's going to be GG against him. Why he's gonna play? I don't know. Now it's going to be tiebreaker and you are so so ahead against him. And I'm going to wait and left him because he was a loser but he played one minute more and taked one minute of our time to win this match oh guys we are in the last part of the match and we finished some uh, great great matchup i hope you uh, enjoy and uh, learn these tactics and enjoy these battles i uh, played my best gameplay in this video and i hope you uh, you could uh, learn even one thing from my video don't forget to guys uh, like my video uh, comment your opinion and also subscribe me please share my video for your friends and please help me to uh, go ahead with uh, motivation uh, motivation and uh, go fresh and stronger than yesterday's and thank you for supporting me farewell until another great video